welcome to the wedding ceremony of Josh Shun and Shirley Yi. It is a great blessing to witness the establishment of a lifelong covenant and commitment between a man, a woman, and God. I've had a brief opportunity to speak with both of them, and I know that God has an amazing plan and path paved for them in this holy union. parents, Jacqueline, who is the mother of not only Josh, but also his loving brothers and sisters who are gathered here with us today. Jacqueline is looking down from heaven, smiling with tremendous love, not only for Josh and Shirley, but seeing all of her children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren united together during these unprecedented times. She has truly blessed all of us. And Herb, Josh's father, who recently passed, is also for this holy union. Shirley and Josh's journey of this union as one will begin today. Although it all started on February 7th of this year, the first date was a humble and modest one. The date began in Chinatown at the Triple Crown restaurant. They were there for several hours talking about various topics, getting to know one another better. They took their first picture together at the restaurant. And needless to say, it was a funny Snapchat filter of them both sporting mustaches. <laughs> For the second date, Josh made special plans since it was Valentine's Day weekend. He wanted to impress Shirley, so he bought her a lovely bouquet, he personally handmade some chocolate dipped strawberries, as well as a bunch of balloons and some other small gifts. The date started off uh, where we are gathered today, but in a different location of this very park. After a short walk, Josh picked out a special spot that would be very memorable, and they had their first kiss. Afterward, they went to the Devon Seafood and Steakhouse for dinner and capped their night off with fun at Gameworks. They continued to see each other every weekend. Josh introduced Shirley to many new and exciting American foods. He took her to Portillo's, The Art of Pizza, and Devil Dogs. This is where she learned that she absolutely loves pizza. <laughs> Shirley introduced Josh to some new Chinese dishes that she cooked from scratch. Josh, without a doubt, loves her steamed buns. <laughs> I, I did not write this. <laughs> I, Josh, take you, Shirley. I, Josh, take you, Shirley, to be my lawfully wedded wife, to be my lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold, to have and to hold, for richer or poorer, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health, in good times and bad, in good times and in bad, until death do we part, until death do we part. And Shirley, if you would please repeat after me. I surely take you, Josh. I surely take you, Josh. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. For richer or poorer. For richer or poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness or in health. In good times and in bad. In good times or in bad. Until death do we part. Until death do we part. Amen. Now we come to the exchanging of rings. I did not lose them, praise the Lord. <laughs> the ring is a circle that has no end, just as their love for one another. God in this 
state of Illinois, you are now husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.